All day, every day, I get questions about facelifting. I'm a facelift specialist, and my facelift is called the Aura Lift. The Aura Lift is a gimmicky name. It's a name that I gave my facelift, well, that a patient gave me an idea for, and I use it because it's too hard for me to say vertical vector modified extended deep plane facelift with mastoid crevasse and sailboat modification. So when you say all that, it's a little too tough. It's much easier to say Aura Lift. But what is the Aura Lift? It is a vertical vector modified extended advanced deep plane facelift, which means we're going into the face from the classic incisions around the hairline into the ear behind the ear. But instead of going in, lifting the skin and tightening muscles and pulling them, which is what you classically would hear about, we do something called a deep plane dissection or a sub smas dissection. That means you actually release the tissue layer under the smas and the platysma, kind of like filleting a fish. You don't go cutting anything, you just grab it and fillet it. And that's how you can detach the different parts of the face in a very healthy, easy way. We lift it up over the smiling muscle roll it back up vertically from where you age, that's called a vertical vector lift, and put it right back down. I don't use anchoring sutures, I don't pull, I don't tighten, I don't do all that. That's old school. What we do now is release, focus everything on the release rather than the stitching and tightening and pulling. Bring it back up, put it back down. The patient gets a bigger lift, bigger mid-face volumization, bigger mid-face improvement, better jawline improvement, better tucking in of the glands, better definition along the jawline, better neck improvement, better collarbone improvement, less scarring, same or faster recovery, less risk, and a much longer lasting, more natural result. So that in essence is the Aura Lift. But if you wanna understand the difference between facelifts, you can read about them on online all you want. What really matters is the photos. You look at one doctor's before and after photos and look at a hundred of them, compare it to another. One of them is gonna give you a better feeling than the other. That's the better doctor.